and welcome to The Fumble. I'm Britt Johnson. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we are a week away from probably one of the biggest, most important election years of our lives. We have heard three debates and seen countless ads and commercials in order to help us decide who is going to be the right person for the job. We have seen these candidates do everything in order to win our vote, everything except juju on that beat, until now that is. Today, my fellow Americans, I present to you the juju, performed by Donald Trump and Hillary Clinton. <laughs> Don't you guys just love Halloween? Now just by looking at the dance contest alone, I would have to say Hillary has it in the bag. Her moves were way better than Donald's and she clearly persuaded that fan holding the beer to vote for Hillary. Now as far as the battle on the hardwood is concerned, the 6-2 guard for the Boston Celtics, Avery Bradley, led the way with a career high 31 points eight of which were three-pointers, and on the way, he also managed to snag 11 boards in the Celtics' 104-98 win over the Hornets. Hornets coach Steve Clifford said that Bradley was terrific. He said, especially in the stretch where they got a little bit of cushion, which ended up being the difference in the game. They're a good team and they played well. You can see why people are saying they'll be top two or three in the East. So the Celtics might be at the top of the East by the end of the season, but the important question here is who do you think was the winner of the dance battle, Donald Trump or Hillary? Let me know in the comments below and don't forget to subscribe to The Fumble before you go and don't forget to vote on November 8th.